DirectFix.com presents iPod Touch 4 Take Apart Directions. Please be sure to visit us on the web at DirectFix.com. At checkout, use coupon code YouTube7 for 7% off your first order. Warning, this content is intended to be used for informational and entertainment purposes only. You're using these video directions and its content at your own risk. AX Microsolution Inc. makes no representation, warranties, or condition of any kind, express or implied. Following these directions on this video will avoid your warranty. You're performing this repair at your own risk. Very carefully point a heat gun at very low setting along the edges of the unit to loosen the adhesive holding the screen down. Make sure it's at a low setting as you do not want to melt the buttons. Once the adhesive is loosened, use a sharp object such as an X-Acto blade or razor blade to pull the screen away from the unit. Run the blade along the edges of the unit and along the top and bottom, being careful of the home button at the bottom. There are two ribbons connecting the screen to the unit. One of them can be easily removed, while the other is connected on the underside of the main board. The battery and main board are protected by a metal shield. There are eight screws holding this shield down. Remove them. Once the screws are removed, the metal shield is easily removed with a case opener tool. Two more screws near the top of the unit hold the main board into the case. Using a case opener tool, begin to pull up the battery and main board from the case. The iPod Touch 4 has two cameras, both of which are connected on the underside of the main board. There is another ribbon cable connected near the bottom of the unit. You 
you should now be able to remove the entire main board and the battery from the case. The final ribbon connecting the screen to the main board can now be easily disconnected. Please be sure to visit our website, directfix.com. Just click the link below to, for all your parts and accessory needs.